guys, Grayson here with Roads and Traveled. Yesterday we crossed the border from Guatemala into El Salvador and ended up hiking the Santa Ana Volcano. Now this was honestly one of the greatest hikes of, my, of the entire trip so far. The turquoise blue water at the top was just absolutely stunning and you had an incredible view over the water. After the hike, it was around 3 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon and we needed to find a place close by that was safe to stay for the night. So we ended up in this small town about an hour and a half away. Now this is one of the smallest towns we've stayed in so far, but they have such a unique culture here with, uh, with amazing local food. It's very relaxed and very quiet. The owner of the hospital that we're staying at has a coffee plantation down the road and uses his grandma's old pickup truck. Now originally they got this thing for about $250 US. This thing is incredible. Now of course it's not in perfect condition, but it's such an original piece that I had to show you guys. So let's go take a look. This 1978 Land Cruiser is not something you come across every day. This unique and classic design has characteristics that are no longer found in modern day trucks. This truck is completely stock with a naturally aspirated straight six diesel engine. The body of this vehicle has some wear and tear, but considering the heavy and consistent use of it, I'm surprised it has held up as well as it has. Now one of the design features of this truck which really stands out is the unique leaf spring setup it has in the front. Hopefully you enjoyed this quick look at this amazing truck and I can't wait to show you some other things that we come across on the road. I'll catch you guys next time.